Did you know that the Earth has a hidden eighth continent? The eighth, a lost continent called Zealandia, isn't a huge landmass that geographers have somehow missed. Rather, only small bits including New Zealand, New Caledonia and few other specks of land in the huge Pacific Ocean are above sea level. The rest of this continent lies beneath the waves. Nick Mortimer, a geologist, said, I hope Zealandia will start to appear on world maps which show the other continents. The new study synthesizes decades of evidence for a hidden continent lying beneath the ocean surrounding New Zealand. First line of evidence comes simply from looking at the ocean floor around New Zealand. The continental shelves of Zealandia lie at depth of about 3,280 feet below sea level, while nearby oceanic crust is about 9,800 feet below that. The second line of evidence supporting Zealandia's designation as a separate continent comes from extensive study of the rocks beneath the ocean. Over the past 20 years, geologists have set sail on ships to dredge rocks from the seafloor. Unlike the nearby oceanic crust, which is made up of basaltic rocks, the crust surrounding New Zealand is composed of a variety of different rock types, including granite, limestone and sandstone. Scientists have shown that there is a narrow strip of oceanic crust separating the continent of Australia from the subterranean reaches of Zealandia, meaning the two are separate continents. Zealandia was born from breakup of the supercontinent of Gondwana about 85 million years ago. At that time, an ocean began to emerge between Australia and New Zealand. Zealandia is somewhat unusual in that just before it separated from the supercontinent of Gondwana, it got stretched. That stretching essentially thinned out the continent crust, making it sink more than thicker continental crust, which tends to float. Compared with other continents, Zealandia is a little bigger than India and half the size of Europe. And although only a tiny amount of the continent is lying above the water currently, at one time its above water footprint was even smaller. The continent reached its maximum level of submergence about 30 million years ago. Now, the movement of the Australian plate is cutting Zealandia in two, which should break the continent in half in tens of millions of years.